Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's vlog, we're gonna go over my BoxyLux subscription with BoxyCharm. If you're not familiar, um, so BoxyCharm is a monthly service where they send over a box with some makeup, skincare, brushes, things like that. You basically do a little quiz when you sign up with BoxyCharm. You tell them what your interests are and you know what are your must-haves and your ass and they basically go ahead and send you a box every single month so every three months you get a boxy Lux box so this has a lot more items in it and i did want to mention with boxy charm you do get full-size products which is just such a money saver and amazing and it also kind of gives me things that i wouldn't normally buy on my own to try things out of my comfort zone so that's what i truly do appreciate about boxy charm and boxy Lux. But without further ado, let's get to unboxing. I am going to go ahead and give you guys all the prices of everything that was included in my September Boxy Lux. It comes with this um, sheet that's basically going to tell you what the product is, what um, it cost. So you can really see the value of everything. And then I'll go ahead and add it up and we'll see how much everything was at the end. So first things first, we have the Violet Voss Essentials Eyeshadow Palette. So this is going to be this one right here. And I'll go ahead and show it to you guys. Let's go ahead and open it. Okay, so let me just remove the film. We have this palette. It's actually really pretty. Um, I live for this cream color. Let's see how pigmented it is. That's kind of like a thing for me. It's, I like to test out how pigmented these colors truly are. I'm just gonna go ahead and grab um, cream on the Morphe M431 and do what I typically do, which is just like, you know, a little inner highlight. I feel like this is so cute and it just brightens up my eyes. So we'll see how that comes up. And I am wearing makeup from work, so, you know, this isn't, you know, fresh and beautiful. Okay, so it is coming up pretty pigmented. I like it. It's really, really cute. I'm really excited to see the other colors here. Um, I feel like we can really have fun with this palette and kind of do something fun. And Halloween's around, right around the corner, so <laughs> adding another palette to the list. So I did want to mention this palette retails for $29. Next on our list we have the Dr. Brandt Hydrobiotic Recovery Sleeping Mask. So again a full size product and I'll show it to you here. Now this says it's a hydrating recovery sleeping mask that balances skin naturally occurring flora and locks in moisture overnight to reduce redness and soothe the signs of irritation. So I have not used this yet. This does retail for $52. I love the fact that BoxyCharm incorporates um, skincare to their boxes because I think that it's just so important. Nowadays everyone is like, okay, skincare is a must. So we are adding all these great things into our skincare regimen, but Dr. Brand as a company, anything that I've used from them, I've absolutely loved. So I'm really, really happy to see this in this, this month's box. So next we have the Hank and Henry Blickety Black Eyeliner. So one thing I will say with BoxyCharm is when I did fill out my quiz, I did mention I did not want any liners because I simply do not use them. And not that this is bad or anything, guys, I just simply don't know how to use liner. I always mess it up. So I probably end up gifting this, but so you can see the tip, that looks really awesome. And I mean, if we can do like a little swatch. Oh, Ooh, it's like very fine lined, if you can see that. So it's actually painted on pretty quickly. I wish I knew how to do this because I really have tried. I really, really have tried and just I suck at it. So it's a flop for me, but I will end up getting this and this does retail for $20. Let's see what's next. So the Stilla Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick. So again, full size product. I love the formula for this lipstick. 
This color is Angelo. It's just not my color. Like, I cannot rock these nudes for the life of me. So I'll probably end up gifting this one to you. The only way I see myself using this is getting, like, this type of color and maybe doing ombre and, like, layering it on top and kind of blending it. But other than that, this shade does not work for me. But this does retail at $22. And... Again, I love the formula. It's a creamy, nice formula. It goes on really well. It just the color does not work for me. All right, so next we have the Too Faced Natural Face Palette. And I did want to mention, not every single Boxylux box is going to be the same. They actually have spoilers, and sometimes Boxylux will even send you an email to tell you, okay, so here's your choices. Would you rather this or that? So I know that they had a couple of palettes from Too Faced for this month. This is the one that I just so happened to get, and this is the Natural Face Palette. But I do want to show you, because I do own it myself, they had the Park Ave Princess Palette as well. And that's just this one. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's very used and used. But it's this one. So let's we'll see what this one is like. But just to give you, you know, a little tip, they do do an offer. They offer varieties of products. Oh, I love this. Oh, and I love the way it smells, and I love that big mirror. That's awesome. So they have really pretty colors here. Um, it does look like this is a little bit more shimmery. Let's see how this works. I'm just gonna grab a little bit of satin sheets. And pop it. Oh, that's really, really pretty. So, so pretty. Oh my god. <laughs> so it's pigmented. <laughs> but it's really, really pretty. Oh my god, I put way too much. I love the way this smells. Um, it's not overwhelming, but it does have a smell to it. And typically, Too Faced products, they usually do. So just, I'm warning you on that. Oh, and I use the Morphe... Sorry, the number scratched off, but it's a fan brush, which I don't typically use anymore, but it was just close to me, so we used it. So the Too Faced Natural Face Palette um, retails for $44. It's probably my favorite thing in the box. Love, love, love. We got the Sunday Riley Tidal Brightening Enzyme Water Cream. This retails for $65. Um, I really love this. Just to show you there. I really love this. I would compare this easily to Tatcha Water Cream, which I just so happen to have the mini version right next to me, and I used the full size already, but the consistency of this, oh yeah, I love that. And if you're not familiar with water creams, they literally, your face just like, it just absorbs them. See how this smells? It has an earthy smell to it very interesting but again guys the reviews on this is amazing and I actually chose this when Boxylux um, emailed me they asked if I wanted this or the brightening serum from another company I chose this and I'm happy I did and I cannot wait to use it okay so next we got the Moda eight piece brush set this retails for $69.99 and I have the box for it and I'll show you the um, brushes in a minute but this is basically the box and these were all the brushes that were included in the set it came like this I opened one this morning and this is supposed to be the powder brush um, however I do feel like it's a little bit more compact if you can see so I used it for bronzer and it worked great um, but I'm actually but yeah you have things here for powder contour glow shader crease smudger detail brow so I really love this I'm actually gonna gift this to a girlfriend at work because she also subscribes to boxy Lux and she got the curling iron which I super super wanted and I have tons of brushes so we're gonna do an exchange there but yeah I think these brushes are really really great again I have so many brushes hi Luna I have so many brushes so I was subscribed to Morphe's subscription for their makeup brushes so you would get like four or five a month and I have a ton of brushes so yeah and then last 
but not least, we have the IGK Mistress Hydrating Balm. It's a leave-in conditioning balm that won't wear your hair down. This actually retails for $29, and I did have the opportunity to use this. Guys, this smells so, so good. And what you'll do is just, it's a leave-in conditioner, so you wash your hair. When it's damp, you'll go ahead and add it. But I was reading the ingredients, and it does mention that you can apply a small amount to your ends after styling so I haven't done that quite yet but it's something that you can do another really awesome thing is it is paraben and sulfate free so for those of you who do have keratin in your hair and you're worried about it having sulfate or anything like that and anybody in general you're good you can use this enjoy and it's anti-frizz leave-in conditioner which your girl is in Florida. We have really bad humidity, so you know that for something here. So I love anything for the hair and skin. That's kind of like my go-to. But let's go ahead and add everything up and see what the value was for this month's um, box. All right, guys, I kid you not, $330.99. That was the total value of product that we received in this box. I probably paid, so your typical BoxyCharm box, I believe is like $21 a month. You pay an additional like $20 a month, give or take. So I'm paying about $40 something dollars and I got $331 worth of product. I would totally recommend Boxy Charm and Boxy Lux. I know there might be a wait list for Boxy Lux, but it's pretty quick. I remember like submitting my, you know, oh I want Boxy Lux, I want to upgrade. I was approved I think within the week. And I did want to note that you do have to have Boxy Charm already to upgrade to Boxy Lux. You are not just able to receive Boxy Lux. But you'll receive a Boxy Lux every third month and then in between you're going to receive regular Boxy Charm boxes which are just as good. I believe you get like maybe five full size products but it's another thing, you get full size products. But alright guys, that wraps up this video. Make sure to go ahead and give this a thumbs up if you learned something today and of course if you just like this video. And make sure to subscribe. We do have some travel vlogs coming up, some really, really exciting ones. Um, we're actually going to Halloween Horror Nights this weekend and Volcano Bay and we're doing the RIP tour for Halloween Horror Nights. Yes, I'm a horror nerd. I'm totally okay with that. And then um, in about 16 days, but who's counting? We are going on Symphony of the Seas. It is the biggest cruise ship in the world right now with Royal Caribbean on a seven night cruise. Me and Andrew, my boyfriend, were celebrating our anniversary, which so happens to be today. Happy two years to us. But yeah, we really are excited. So make sure you go ahead and hit that notification bell so that you're notified when those videos do come up. Thank you so much for watching. I'm pleased to see you seeing me and until next time. Bye.